improvements to the GitHub releases are now GA and available to everyone. I'm talking about the new redesign release UI and automatically generated release nodes. Hey, welcome back to Carded Day, where we talk about DevOps, especially with GitHub and Azure DevOps. The releases UI refresh gives more clarity into what's included in a given release and recognitions for contributors in the community. GitHub has also made pagination significantly better and introduced new search functionalities. And now we have a handy comparison feature right in the UI to be able to compare two releases. But this is not all, because as I've already mentioned, now we also have the possibility to have automatically generated release nodes. This provides an automated alternative to manually writing release nodes for your GitHub releases. With automatically generated release nodes, you can now quickly generate an overview of the contents of a release, and you can also customize your automated release nodes using labels to create custom categories to organize pull requests you want to include and exclude certain labels and users from appearing in the output. You can also customize the automatically generated release nodes by creating a template for them. This template is a YAML file, you can see an example here on screen, which must be called release.yaml and placed in the .github folder in the root of your repo. Hit the like button below if you're enjoying this video or you find it insightful so more people can benefit from it, and of course that would mean a lot to me, thank you. Also, if you're into new features, check out this video over here in which I covered the reusable workflows in GitHub Action that have been recently released. But that's it for me. Thanks so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. Hit the like button below, subscribe if you haven't already, and I see you in the next video here at Carter Dave. Oh.